Hey Taurus, welcome to your weekly love reading. I hope you guys are feeling all good this week. Um, this reading is for the 22nd to the 28th of March and it's a general reading so please only take what messages resonate. If you do like this reading please feel free to give me a thumbs up and let me know in the comments. Um, if you would like to see more readings then please feel free to subscribe and hit the notification bell. Um, for personal readings and links to my other social medias, all that info is in the description box below. Okay, so let's get started on your love reading. See what is going on with you guys and your love life from the 22nd of March to the 28th of March. What energies are you going to be experiencing in regards to your love life, Taurus? Taurus is love life. From the 22nd to the 28th of March. Okay, this is your present energy surrounding your romantic love life. This is your recent past energy. This is the energy guiding you. This is something you need to know. This is your near future energy. This is your energy. And this is your person's energy. Bottom of the deck, we have got the Eight of Wands. Very fast moving energy, incoming energy here. I'm... I'm having this one message like you've had enough. Um, but again, this could just be for a few of you. We'll see what's coming up here. Okay, present energy surrounding your romantic love life. We have the lovers. So this is beautiful energy here. This is harmony. This is a union, a divine union here. This is like major soulmate energy. This is around you presently. This is guided energy. This is divine energy. This is a divine union taking place in the present. Now, this could be actually in the physical or this could be energetically um, occurring. Um, if it is energetic presently, then I do feel like this person is going to be actually physically coming in into the physical um, real soon. Recent past energy, we have the High Priestess. Wow. So, yeah, this is very intuitive. This is knowing. I feel like either you or your person know you're the one. It's like you know this is the one. There's been a lot of balance that you've been doing. There's been a lot of growth that you've had. I feel like there's been a lot of um, karmic completions that you've done, that you've been... You, you've become wise, you've become wise and you're beginning a new journey now um, where you have the wisdom, you have all that wisdom, you've, co you've completed a huge cycle, a huge, huge karmic cycle, you've got this wisdom and you've got this beautiful divine union, the energy that's guiding you is justice, yeah and I feel like this is, this is justice for you, for what you have risen above, what you've completed, the karma that you completed, the karmic connections, the karmic cycles, everything that you cleared, all that wisdom that you gained. And I feel like you really went through something major. You really did. You've leveled up in a huge way, not just an average way, like you're a whole new person here. And this justice is literally uniting you with your true divine person. I feel like in the recent past you may have broke up with somebody, you may have left somebody or you may have left a few people, different connections, you freed yourself, you understood, you learnt the lessons there. You understand things a lot deeper, you understand love a lot deeper. Something that you need to be aware of this week, we have the Queen of Pentacles. Okay, so yeah. I am feeling like you are bringing this person into the physical. I don't know why. I just feel like this is kind of energetic at the moment. But you're going to bring them. You're, attra you're going to attract them into the physical. 
you're very uh, grounded, very stable, very abundant. You, your feminine energy is so on point. Your feminine energy is really leading you in the most beautiful on point way at the moment and you're attracting to you your divine partner. I feel this is energetic union. Um, now, this justice, this is that feminine energy bringing in your match. Karmic scales have been balanced and you're going to get your reward here. The near future energy. Wow. Yeah, this is your, this is twin flame union. Four of wands. This is twin flame union. This is your divine counterpart. You're coming into union here. You're connecting. You're coming into union. As I say, this may be going on in the physical but I feel this is kind of going on energetically and you're attracting it into the physical. You really are. You're attracting your true partner, your true counterpart in to unite with you in the physical. You're united energetically. There is this energetic marriage between you. Your energy for the week ahead is the sun. Wow. Your energy is amazing. This is beautiful energy, absolutely beautiful. You're fully aligned. You're enlightened with that high priestess energy as well in the sun. You are literally, and I just feel like you have risen above kind of most people that you were connected with. It sounds weird and not to sound in an egotistical way, but say if you were connected with somebody in the past, like a karmic partner, and you had karmic friendships and you had karmic family connections, or you were in a karmic situation with work, I feel like you stepped above all of that. That is still going on. Those connections are still mingling all together, but it's like you've been put on a whole different plane now. And your whole life is going to change because you're uniting with a much higher vibrational energy here. You, you're going to be united, or you are already physically united, with your true counterpart. And this is beautiful. This is, so, there's just so much alignment going on here. So your person, we have here karma. Now, this is what, this is, this just supports as well what I'm kind of feeling here because I feel this is energetic. I feel this energy here is energetic. This is kind of energetic. It hasn't necessarily come into a physical into the 3D, the physical world yet, okay, it is going to come in, I feel like you're attracting it in, but at the moment, you have done all this work, you're manifesting this and attracting this in, and justice is on your side to bring this situation in, now this person, this is either this person, and they are closing up karma as we speak, or this is somebody, if you have left somebody in the past, then they are still kind of going through the lessons of karma. Let's take a look. I want to take a look at the lovers first. I want to take a look at this person. Two of cups. <laughs> this is your person. They're coming in. Three of wands. They're coming in towards you. They are coming in towards you. You're attracting this person into your life. The magician. Yep. You're manifesting them. You're manifesting. And I feel that this well this could be you may already know this person or this could be a new person but this is your twin flame this is your divine counterpart here so this four of wands in the near future is the ten of cups oh my gosh guys oh my gosh oh my gosh i just can't i really really can't so the queen of pentacles something that you need to know we have this queen of pentacles we have temperance here. So there is some sort of healing going on. So it, you may actually attract another earth sign to you. Um, I feel like this is you though. I feel like you're going through some sort of healing and alchemy. And you're bringing... You know when they say like you manifest and you have to feel the emotion to as part of the manifestation process you know you've got to feel it i feel like this is what you're kind of doing here yeah you're not feeling sad anymore you're changing your emotions you're not feeling sad you're not dwelling on the past you're feeling victorious and you're riding for victory yeah this is amazing 
Justice. What does Justice want to say? Justice wants to say there's, there is going to be a big, huge tower. So I'm actually thinking that this person here is going through a karmic closure. There's a tower to take you to this high priest here, this hierophant energy. Okay, and there is a change from the old into the new. Major change, life changes as well. This is life changing. I feel like some of you, you may have left somebody. You may have left somebody and that is part of who you're, who you're being taken away from and taken towards somebody new. We'll see who this person is here, this karma. So this may be somebody that you were dealing with or it may be at this new person. We have the star. This is this is your person. This is the person coming in. They're closing up some karma. They're getting some enlightenment as we speak. They're doing some healing. They're destined for this. They are the emperor here. Taking responsibility. Dealing with karma. Sorting stuff out that they need to. They're not confused. They don't want, they don't want any other options. They just want to get this done. I, maybe this is this person I've had enough they want to get this done they're completing it they're moving forwards really quickly what do they want they want six of cups they want this soulmate connection they want the empress they want their empress we've got the emperor and the empress here together look they want their empress they want their soulmate they're focused they're focused they're not distracted by other cups um, they want wish fulfillment and they want to come in and say, howdy doody. <laughs> they want to come in and say, hey, <laughs> look at this guy. He cracks me up. Um, yeah, they want, they want to come in. They want the wheel of fortune. That's what they want. Your person wants the same thing as you. They're getting in alignment with you. So this is somebody new or this is somebody that you knew before who is, I don't feel they are in physical contact with you as of yet but they are coming in they're getting they're getting ready they get closing things up taking responsibility taking charge of certain things that they need to take charge of the karma that they're doing doesn't necessarily have to be in a romantic sense it could be with other people it could be with family members it could be with business anything it can be anything but they're closing up at a super fast rate their karma to be to come and meet you here. You are drawing them in. You're attracting them in. You are the empress. You're drawing them into you here. This is amazing. Absolutely amazing. Yep, you're moving forwards. You're moving on to something new here. Literally something new. Something new is coming in in the physical. You're moving away from stress and anxiety. And confusion. It's no more. This justice energy is moving you away from that. Your life is literally going to be amazing because there was no there was no abundance with that. There was no change. There was nothing that you know. You kept working on something. And there was no abundance or change. And I think you realise that with that high priestess in the recent past. You learnt those lessons. That's what I've got for you here this week. Let me know how that resonates with you, and. Enjoy this, guys. This is amazing energy. This is beautiful energy. Have a great week.